Great. Yes. That if, point. if we need to, to, to catch some flights or images, I can move the laptop, so it will not be a problem. Behind the camera, as, as uh, last time, uh, our two engineers from uh, uh, development, uh, research and development, the R&D department are present, so if there are some questions I can't answer, they will help me. They are not in front of the camera, but they are present with me. That's fine. Okay, yeah. okay, that's fine. That's fine. All right. So, um, Dr. Tim, uh, Dr. Ladrigo, this is this is your floor. I will just be watching. <laughs> okay. Okay. Yes, ma'am. So, okay. so that's that's why I don't I know rest. how many how many other people have joined. Um, actually, I really want the um ONG team. Perhaps just give me two minutes to call them. All right. Then. I so, want ONG team. Yes. They, they'll be they'll be the ones to really receive the chair. So I'll just. Just give me two minutes. Let me get around to call everybody. Yeah, I think um, uh, Dr. Monday just, uh, I just, I'm having okay. him now. Uh, yeah. Yes. 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 All right. Uh, you know, because this uh, saves me coming to Abuja, you know. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, yes. You must take advantage of, uh, of, okay. of the, uh, yes. of the virtual meetings. Yes. All Thank right. You. Okay, you can go ahead and do the calling. Uh, Dr. Uh, Monday. Call Good afternoon. Good afternoon, everyone. How good are you? Afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon, sir. Fine, thank you. Uh, yeah, good afternoon. Yeah, good afternoon. So we have um we we um Dr. Ladipo said others need to join. Okay. So she's trying to give give them a call. Yes. Yeah, meanwhile, yes. yeah. So yes. um the the, the chair is behind uh, Mr. Petkovic. And um, according to him, the team okay. of research and development, they are behind, uh, they, are, they are in the uh, in the office with him. So the team are ready. <laughs> yes. Oh, that's... How we can help you? He, he's trying to, that um, Dr. Ladipupo requested for additional one or two minutes because she wants other doctors to to join the platform please okay i am yeah. we'll, we'll we'll wait a couple of seconds yeah that's fine yeah that's fine Thank it, you, was, it was uh, it would be much easier if i received some questions before this meeting so i can prepare some answers but uh, yeah, no matter we, uh, anyway we you know we, we the, the meeting will continue in the in the was a whatsapp chat so okay based on this presentation anyone with or any, any any of the department with any uh, question can easily okay. throw it. Okay. Um, so while we are waiting, well, when is the meeting in Germany again? A meeting in? Sorry, the uh, the, the the event in Germany. Uh, you, you think uh, OBGN Congress? Is it, next yes. Week. Yes. And uh, we we have in next week we have um, a school of ultrasound for Monday and Tuesday. And from Wednesday till Friday will be OBGN Congress here in Banyaluka. And there will be more than 100 doctors from, from Bosnia, from uh, uh, Serbia and, and Montenegro. Because, and after that we have a stand at the medical fair in Germany. Yes. It's in, in, in Düsseldorf. It's from 15 to 18 November. Oh, great, great. Well, the, the reason I ask is because on the 30th of November, I'm hosting a business summit here in Budapest. Uh, I, 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 um, I will be inviting the Nigerian businessmen here, here in Europe and in the UK. Uh, the Federal Minister of Industry and Trade, I, I also invited him. He will be coming from Nigeria. Um, I think it will be it will be ideal for. I mean, it will be very easy to bring one of the chairs or a prototype from Bayanluka to Budapest. Uh, so we, we, we will talk about that uh, later on, you know, so that the Nigerians... It will not be a problem. We will organize that. Oh, okay, that's fine. Thank you so much. So we have Doc, uh, sorry, Dr. Williams Matthew. Uh, good afternoon, sir. Okay, he is muted. All right, because of time, um, the floor is now to you, Dr. Lalibu and Dr. Monday. I will just keep quiet. 
Okay, we are, we are waiting for, for them to yes. do. All right, I will get my mic now. Thank you. All right, I think we are, I just added um, Dr. Manasoko Dani, Dania. All right, I, I think, I think, I think there is a crowd of doctors already, so. That's nice to hear. <laughs> Good to have an um, audience for our presentation, so. Yes, I mean, I mean, trust me, these are the people that they need to listen to you and um, ask you questions. It's much better than the last time. <laughs> <laughs> but Dr. Mode said he forgot that they were one hour ahead. I mean, it happens as well yeah. sometimes. So. <laughs> I was using three o'clock. <laughs> yes, yes, it happens. It's, it's, it's not... Um, the difference is just one hour, so it's not... It's not, it's not much, yeah. You know, sometimes yeah. when, when, we, when we forward the clock, it will be two hours. Yes. You know, yeah. So, but uh, Europe is just nearby, you know, compared to America and Canada and other parts of the world. Yes. When when we when we call to uh, Asia, it's uh, five six hours the difference. So difference exactly. Yeah. So, sometimes it's difficult to set uh, meeting or phone uh, conversation. For for Nigeria, it's not problem because it's just one hour. Yeah. 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 When I when I have meetings online with my American partners. They have to wake up, or I, I have to wake up in the middle of the night, you know. So, several times I called, uh, several, I called in uh, 11, uh, 11 o'clock uh, p.m. So I wait before I go to sleep just to, to make a conversation and set all things and then go to sleep. Exactly. And that's funny for them. Yeah. Because in, in America it's morning. It's morning, exactly. Yeah. All, all right. Um, Dr. Ladbukwa, I don't know whether. You already have the team because of time. Oh yes, I think um, Dr. Grace, Dr. Grace is here. Dr. Manasoko, she's the head of ONG, and with our big chief here, the MD. I think we will just start while the others can join. All right. Okay, I will mute my mic. So um, the floor is yours, ma'am. Thank you. So my understanding is that we are going to have um, uh, we are going to have the vendors actually demonstrate. So I think we we'll just watch, and if we have questions, we'll ask afterwards. If that's All right. okay. All right, that's fine. So Mr. Petkovic, you can we'll, go ahead now. Okay, uh, we we will start with the presentation regarding. Um, uh, I, I will call my colleague. Uh, he will explain everything and um, practically we we will do some uh, movements of the chair, speak about materials, quality, education, etc. So I will, I will make a, a small introduction. Uh, OBG and chairman the B100, it's a model. It started uh, with the idea five years ago and uh, two years ago we start with the production. So, uh, this is, this is a new model because a um, uh, model from uh, last year didn't have uh, some advanced act functions. So in this year we change electronics and um, hand controls. So this model has some advanced function as a home button if you want to, uh, when patient has to uh, sit or, or, or remove from, from a chair. We have an emergency button if um, uh, uh, we need to, to uh, give a first aid to, to, uh, to, to a woman. Uh, we have a button for if, you, if we want to, to uh, change from a normal position to, to bad position if you want to uh, work ultrasound. 
and we have three position which doctors can uh, make uh, memorized position if they want some specific position to have just with one button so we will show practically what what uh, you know, how that works regarding uh, uh, complete uh, chair everything is made here in in, in bosnia in Benovuka, except that some of the components we import uh, that's uh, uh, echo leather, it's imported from a Swiss, uh, high quality leather, uh, which uh, uh, which meets all medical standards regarding the infection and, and quality. And motors and uh, hand and foot controls are from France because we choose, uh, it's a company which is in top three in the world regarding uh, motors and electronics for uh, OBGYN chairs for hospital beds and for operating tables. So we are trying to uh, choose uh, verified suppliers with a, a huge uh, uh, knowledge in, in, in that area. So uh, all other components are made here. So we will we will show you a little bit how that looks like. So I will I will take my laptop so to to, to bring a little bit uh, closer because I don't know how much you you see it in background. And my colleague uh, uh, Donna from R&D department will show some uh, one part. Uh, I will I will try to move it. So I will need just a moment of help from your side. I know. How, how, how much you see? Can you see it normally? Okay, all, all uh, mics are muted. I will, I will um, call my colleague Zoran just to show uh, hand controls with operation buttons. Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, I will now take Hello. our presentation. I will bring the controls further so I hope you can see a little bit better. Our hand controls have uh, six uh, rows. The first three are uh, for separately moving the motors of the chair. Our chair has three motors, one for the height adjustment, one for the uh, seat inclination adjustment, and the uh, third one is for the uh, backrest adjustment. Uh, we have uh, in the fourth row uh, home button position and three memorized positions for the doctors. Uh, one button uh, to go to the horizontal position uh, for the ultrasound uh, examination and one button for the trendelenburg uh, position. Uh, I already have a uh, preset uh, one uh, memorized position uh, to get to the chair too, so I'm going to press them so you can see, see how the uh, chair is uh, moving uh, after that. Uh, the chair right now to the highest position, uh, the motor uh, one is at the highest position, motor two also, and the backrest is at the maximum position. You can use now uh, also one button, the home position, after the examination is complete, to get the chair to the beginning position so that the patient can easily uh, move uh, from the chair. Uh, the, uh, uh, the minimum height uh, position from the chair is uh, 590 millimeters, so the patient can easily access the chair and uh, easily be uh, later removed from the chair. Uh, it, how we can see, it only takes 10, sec 10 seconds to go from the lowest position to the, the uh, from the highest position to the lowest position. Uh, after that, we can, uh, if, the, if during the examination patient gets to the, have some uh, problems or that, then we can easily go to the condemned uh, position, uh, getting the chair to the 20 degrees. Uh, information to the patient can easily be uh, CPR. I hope you can uh, get to see the 20 degree uh, inclination. And after that, we can also put the horizontal button uh, to get the chair to the uh, horizontal position so the patient can rest a little bit or we can perform other examination. And after that, again, we can get the chair to the uh, beginning position. Uh, 
all the uh, positions buttons are clearly marked on the uh, hand control so uh, everyone is, so it's very easy to use and uh, also uh, besides the uh, hand controls we also have the foot controls that are uh, really really easy to use and robust uh, with the foot controls we don't have uh, the uh, memory position on them they are only used uh, for the uh, small uh, manipulation of the chair during the, the exam or uh, intervention uh, the, the controls the foot and uh, the hand controls all have the ip uh, 66 protection protection for the water they are all, uh, all water resistant so they can be used during uh, the intervention to the patient so there won't be any uh, problems with that area. Uh, we are now going to uh, move uh, to the uh, leather of the chair. Uh, the leather of the chair is high quality Zenskin uh, leather. Uh, this is the new uh, line uh, for uh, made this year uh, due to the COVID pandemic. Uh, so it's easier to clean, disinfect, and uh, during the uh, time the virus is on the uh, surface of the leather, 99% of the viruses are uh, killed only uh, by the leather itself. Uh, all the leather parts are all, all easily uh, removed so it can be easily washed and, and after the clinician. So, uh, so if any, any questions, uh, me and my uh, CEO, Boris Alpatovic, are there to answer. I want to, I want to um ask a few questions to Zoran because he can't remember all things. Uh, here in, in our showroom we have got uh, the accessories uh, at our chair because we didn't bring it. So probably you saw on our website there is an extender for legs, we call it leg plate, which we transform this OVGN chair to a table for ultrasound exams. Also we have uh, Colposcope uh, holder is uh, in this moment uh, it will be uh, ready for a laser gun uh, colposcope, but we can uh, adapt it for other for size or for Olympus or some other. Also, uh, I want to mention there is uh, also a lamp which can all, all accessories will be able to put on this rail. Uh, holders from the side, we have four rail holders. I will bring it to it closer. You, you can see it. So from from left side, you have on sit place you have a rail holder, and on the back for inclusion stand for EV pole, we have one stand. So same situation is from other side, we have four rail holder two from each side. Also, in, in standard configuration, we deliver a paper holder. It's a 60 centimeters, which can hold paper for, for OVGN chair. Uh, our uh, OVGN chair is uh, equipped standardly in, in, in basic uh, configuration with three motors. We don't deliver our uh, product with one, two, sorry. Sorry, uh, we don't deliver our product with one, two, or three motors. Uh, standard standard configuration is with three motors because we want to to improve possibilities uh, our, of our product. Also, we can uh, show you there is. A, uh, can can you see it's a. It's a ball for 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 fluid, so it's um, it's possible to adapt if if it's using for urology with a, with a pipe for a sink or drain rope. So if you have some questions for us, because I will I will try to show you because we have not so much space here from a side, but you have 30 60 degree uh, of product at our, at our website so we can send you high quality image to your email also we can make all the videos we, we can make a video for you if you have some special request and send you in high resolution over a dropbox or a transfer 
You can see, see movement with 360 degrees. Also, we have we have different um, uh, leg holders. This is for intervention. We have for uh, normal exams. It's uh, with with a uh, step. The uh, foot to rest, the compass center. So, uh, we call that the accessory compass center. And we will also uh, put the material in the quarters of the with the center. I think, I think you, you can see it in, in catalog. I yeah. already sent you. Yes. Uh, so, uh, Dr. Uh, Dania is raising her hand. A question. Okay. Yeah. Good afternoon and oh, all good day, everybody. Good day. Yes, please. Um, thank you for the presentation. Uh, um, just wanted to find out: is this um chair can it be used in the theater? Can it be used in the theater? Does it have armrests for the patient? If the patient uh, maybe wants want to do a vaginal procedure in theater. Is it possible? Uh, and does it have armrests? Armrests yes, yes, for the possible. arms of the patient? I understand. Okay. It's possible because of that we, we put this uh, real side. So in this moment, we can't deliver armrests because we, okay. we are uh, making in this moment prototype because we have a lot of accessories. Some are finished, some are not. So armrest is planned to be um, uh, built uh, until the, the end of this year. Because we have okay. a lot of requests because of anesthesia in, in open theater. I know what, what, what you are asking. Okay, thank you. It that, will be available that, that, until the I end want... of the year. Okay, secondly, a second question. Please, I don't know, I, I, I don't know if I heard that, but does it have a preset? Can you preset it to specific um, kinds of lithotomy position where for a particular surgeon, uh, if he wants exaggerated lithotomy or um, the sitting kind of lithotomy, is is it possible to pre preset it to those settings so yes. that when you are going in for your procedure, you don't have to start trying to okay, okay. We we have free uh, free uh, available position you can memorize. You bring manually by controls uh, position okay. you are wanted to use. And after th that, you keep few seconds for a memory po po position button. And that first po uh, memory pos uh, uh, position will be memorized and you can use it. You have free position, which you can make uh, by yourself. If, if, it's, uh, if it's your question, uh, we have uh, just a moment. I'll, I'll show you again. Oh. I don't know. Can you can you see now? We have we have three. As you see, this small image of doctor. It's a free button. You can memorize your oh, okay. own position. Okay. And this free position are already preset. It's home button when you want to, to when the patient comes and sit on the chair and when we finish the exam, we have a horizontal position. It's for ultrasound exam. And we have trend work. It's uh, when, when it's uh, first aid for, for, uh, for a patient if it's uh, really bad. So you can move the head uh, 20, 20 degrees below zero, if you understand me. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. You're welcome. Also, we didn't show, we have here on, on uh, uh, comments, we have small key. When when you leave your office, if you don't want uh, to do persons who are in charge for cleaning of the room, to, to move that position or to use that chair. Uh, it's a, some, some kind of safety key. You can lock it. Do not touch uh, some other persons which are not uh, allowed to, to use it. 
if it's necessary. So. Hello, can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you. Okay, my name is Caroline. Although I didn't come very early, um, I, I'm from NISA, I represent NISA Supply Chain. Okay. I, I just want to find out from you guys, how do you handle the after sales support and spare parts when they didn't arise? Do you have a representative in Africa or in Nigeria to be precise? No, no we, we are now in this moment, we are um, asked for this, we are trying to find distributors. So we need we need company from, from your country, which will be our uh, partner for sale and support in, in Nigeria. In this moment, we haven't got um, authorized reseller for, for um, Nigeria or other countries in Nigeria and in Africa. So if there is some company which is interested for a distribution of this product, we will be able to, to send them all um, service manuals and to do education regarding servicing and maintenance for, for your country. In this moment, we haven't got distributor for, for Nigeria. All right, thank you. You're welcome. Any, any other question? Okay, I think, um, okay. thank you so much for the presentation. Yeah. I think most okay. of my questions and comments have actually been mentioned by the previous speakers. So, but um, thank you for bringing this um, multifunctional, very dynamic equipment that um, can accommodate a wide range of movements depending on the procedure one requires. That's what I can see from the demonstration. So um, I think most of my questions have been asked. I was going to ask about the control, whether it's for the patients or the doctors. Then I saw that we also have um, the pedal control. Yes. Does it do the same thing as the remote does? That's number one. So I was going to also ask about maintenance issues because of the proximity. So Miss Caroline has asked that. If they are represent, if you have a representative in the country, but I, I learned that we don't have at the moment. So I, I know you would also be kind enough to tell us if there are other people that have used this. What are the common challenges that the previous users had? If if that's okay to ask, then also I was going to ask about warranty for the products, just in case we okay. we are procuring anyone soon. Thank you. Warranty for, for this product is 24 months. And in case uh, we haven't got distributor in your country, uh, I, in, in big hospitals, there is um, uh, support. Probably you, you already have support in, in your hospital because you need, for, for, a high, for a bigger hospital, you need to have one person who, who is in charge for um, maintenance and communication with other suppliers. So if there is interest for, for our product, we can uh, do education for that uh, person in your hospital uh, to, to support us. That's, that's, that's also uh, one solution we can offer. So that's like the after sales um, service um, yeah. for the product. Yeah, I mean, um, well, the, the idea of this meeting is basically to introduce the products uh, personally, what I do is I ensure the best and innovative products and bring it to Nigeria. And um, because of my relationship with Nissan, I believe if there's going to be any hospital at all, that one will understand the importance of innovative uh, product. It's, it's going to be Nisa. Um, but at the same time, we, as soon as there is an uh, expression of interest. The after sales part will certainly be uh, handled as well by me, uh, by working with the company in Bosnia, ensuring that the right company back at home, I mean, the right medical uh, companies back at home, you know, partner with them. But uh, the, uh, the, the, the idea is to, to launch this product via Nissan Hospital. And I believe the necessary support will certainly be available. Uh, the team back in Bosnia are actually ready to, 
to be present in 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 uh, in Abuja and, and, and working with Nissan Hospital to ensure that there is training, there is uh, 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 maintenance as well. That will certainly be discussed later on. Um, Mrs. Uh, Thank Carol, you. Thank you. Uh, William, uh, Matthew, I hope that's, that's understandable because I know you're the one that raised that question, which is very important. Yes. 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 That that will be that will be taken care of. That will be taken care of. All right. Well done. Well done. Yes. Yeah. Any other question, Doctor Monday? Yes. Thank you very much, sir. Yes, sir. Any questions? I, yeah. I think um yes. Thank you. Thank you so much, Mister Dada. I I really enjoyed it. I enjoyed when Boris Lava was making the presentation. I followed it carefully. And um, I think it's a very good thing and a good innovation. And it's something that I know that um, we would need, not just in NISA, but I'm sure across the country, you said it clearly that you would like NISA to uh, be the first to launch it. I know uh, we have similar bed. However, the issue about this one that makes it stand out is the flexibility in the range of movements you know, vis-a-vis -vis the control uh, panel and the pedal control. Uh, it makes it very good. What we have seen more commonly is the one that, of course, the pedal is there, but the only point of adjustment is only at that point where you uh, where you fix it to the bed. Unlike this one that has three layers, I mean, three possible areas or knots where you can make adjustments. It makes it very wonderful. We've seen some being used in fertility clinics because a lot of the procedure uh, in either little to be position or something similar or sometimes some exaggerated uh, positions so this will make it very easy even on, on the side of gynecological uh, other gynecological procedures i know dr grace asked questions earlier so it's a very lovable thing it is good um particularly um for the place like the nisa international hospital in metama that is coming up i know it is something that um we need to look into because that is an area I'm sure we need. We're doing a lot of high-end things and I know we're not going to put substandard things or things that, are, that may not be in full. It's one thing to think of the expertise. It's another thing to think of very quality equipment as well and things that are, you know, world, cl uh, world class. So it's a very good thing. One question of interest is the cost. If we are going to talk of per unit, I hope it is, it is um, customer friendly. That is another significant um, thing we need to really look at. And if you ask me, I know Dr. Wada, you know, Dr. Wada has been at the forefront of this particularly. So it's something that we really need to get him into it. And um, I'm not so sure if um, Dr. Grace, I don't know. Okay, Dr. David is also here. I know um, they are particularly in the labor world all the time. I don't know if this bed also uh, works for delivery or if it is similar to something I've heard about previously. So I want one of them to also add if it has to do with uh, if it's if it can serve the purpose, the same purpose for delivery as well. You know, but you would respond by telling me about the cost. It's a very wonderful product and I thank you for giving us this opportunity. And um, I'm very sure the management will look into it, especially when the end users give, um, I mean, their approval, so to speak. Thank you, sir. All right. Welcome. I, I, will, I will give a word to Mr. Dada because I will coordinate with you uh, regarding, I will, I will send him a price list so he will introduce you regarding all the details. Regarding uh, transportation cost, we have to check because uh, normally on, uh, for one piece, uh, probably it's expensive, but we will check uh, communication and also I think there's a more, Mr. Dada has a more experience regarding uh, uh, connections from Europe to, to, to Nigeria and regarding costs for one euro pellet because um, our product is uh, size one euro pellet uh, so it's uh, some uh, normal normal size because it's, if we have uh, products which is not uh, uh, its size uh, as a one uh, euro pellet then, then it's more expensive so Mr. Dada will forward you all details regarding the pricing. So I think he agreed with me. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Um, well, one thing I want you to tell them is um, 
what is the duration of completion? If, for example, a request is, okay, uh, maybe Nissan needs two or three uh, today, uh, how long will, will, will it take your company to get this ready? How many pieces? Let's say, okay, Mr. Monday, maybe, maybe, maybe let, let, let me throw it to Dr. Monday. <laughs> <laughs> okay, for example, if we say, um, let's say, if we use an example of five, six, for instance, uh, if we're looking at only the Metama projects, I'm just using that as an example, okay. or if we want to add a total, but I'm sure it will be between five and 10, for instance. Okay. If we if we uh, speak in present time, uh, from five to ten pieces in this moment, it, it can be available for fifteen days, two weeks, ready for shipment. Okay. So we uh, always uh, always regarding delivery, um, we need to receive requests because it changes from time to time. So in this moment yeah. today, I know it's available that quantity and it can be ready for shipment maximum two weeks. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, sir. All right. Thank you so much for your time, uh, yes. doctors. Because I, I know I have not had response about the delivery Sorry, aspect. Doctor Monday, it should be yes. the, it should be them that will tell us whether it can be used for TV. <laughs> you okay. understand? The delivery sure points we are used to are not wide sure enough. That and this mm -hmm. doesn't look wide okay. enough. Oh, okay. Know. Maybe they can let okay. us know. Okay. Any over, comments on that? Over to you, uh, Mr. Pekovic. Uh, I mean, the question is, can, can it be used for delivery? Uh, I didn't hear you, sorry. Ken, I can didn't you, hear your question. No, I think the doctor should ask, ask you again. Dr. Monik, could you repeat the question so that he can... Uh, can it be used, okay, can it be used for delivery or just strictly gynecological procedures? Just uh, OBGYN procedures, it can't be, uh, it, it's impossible to use it as a delivery bed. Maybe, maybe you can use it, but uh, we didn't uh, produce them for that purpose because delivery bed has to be a little bit wider and there is, it has to uh, need some accessories for, for child births. So it's not our intention to, to sell for that purpose, just for a, Exams and intervention okay. for OBGYN and for urology. All right. Do you, do you have Thank any? You so uh, do you have any at uh, the moment? All right. Uh, Pro uh, probably uh, it's possible, but we don't suggest. It's our, our intention in our uh, old documents. It's not for for uh, delivery, just for examination and then treatment. Thank you. Thank you, sir. I appreciate. It. All right. Then. Thank you so you much. Know. Yeah. Um. Dr. Olandi Fuko, I believe that should be it, or, or you want to finalize the meeting? Yeah, that, that's all. That's all. Thank, thank you very much. Thank you very much for the presentation and the opportunity. For, for your presence and yeah. for your time. All Dr. Right. David joined too. I don't know if he, at what point, if he got you. something because of the discussion. Yes, that's Dr. David Ejinobo. Any question? Any uh, yeah. comment? Um, thank you very much for the presentation. Sorry, I joined a little bit late. Clinic is a little bit easy, but I'm definitely to get enough time to listen for the last few minutes. Um, yeah, I think my comment is still what everybody has said. And um, yeah, I'll leave the most of the discussion to Dr. Monday to guide us on how to proceed forward. But, in terms of their usefulness in examination, I think that is kind of established. Uh, um, and it's also been established that they are not going to The patient does not have which of the ones are you in? What's her name? Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, well, basically, what I'm going to do is I will kind of give, um, I'll give a summary. Uh, I'll try and edit the video and um, uh, convert it to a YouTube link so that the the doctors can easily watch it again. Uh, don't worry, it's not going to be a file that will that will occupy your <laughs> your space. So I, I know how it's going to. It, it, it will be like a link that you can easily watch uh, on YouTube to so that everyone will be carried along, particularly those who came late. 
All right. Thank you very much uh, for the time. Uh, we will be in touch. Thank you. Uh, Dr. Thank you. Monday, I'll <laughs> right. over to you. Thank now. you, sir. You heard me tell Dr. Wadada that I've, I've done my bit. <laughs> because he yes. said he wants yes. it. Yes. Yeah. All right, then. Yes. Thank Take you care. so much, sir. All right. All right. I appreciate it. All yeah. right. And if there's any other further questions, we can throw it at the, uh, the, at the WhatsApp group. WhatsApp. Uh, okay. okay. Yeah. Uh, Take care. My pleasure to, to have a conversation. Thank you. Yeah. And if we need some clarification, yeah. we can organize a game meeting or uh, via WhatsApp group, as uh, Mr. Dada told us. Yeah. Thank you very much. All right, then. Take care. Thank you. Bye bye. All right. Bye bye. Have a nice day. Yeah. Cool. Bye.